Hi, welcome. Uh, in this video, I'm going to go through problem 27. Problem 27 says if x plus 2y times dy dx is equal to 2x minus y, what is the value of d squared y dx squared, which is a second derivative, at the point 3 comma 0? Okay, so we just need to f evaluate the second derivative at the point 3 comma 0. That seems fairly straightforward. Um, First, uh, because we start off with x plus 2y times dy dx, and dy dx is not solved for, um, we will solve for dy dx, 2x minus y. So isolating dy dx is a fairly straightforward task. We divide by x plus 2y and um, x plus 2y. <clears throat> and so we get that dy dx is equal to 2x minus y over x plus 2y. Okay, now, um, d squared y, dx squared, not to be confused, and that's why the notation is that way, not to be confused with dy dx squared, right? Um, d squared y dx squared, which is a second derivative, we get to by doing d dx of um, dy dx. That is to say, by taking the derivative of the derivative. That's how you've always found the second derivative, so that part shouldn't be surprising. Okay, got it. Um, so then I just need to find the derivative of this. So d squared y dx squared, the second derivative, is going to look like... Applying quotient rule here, um, the derivative of the top, which is 2... Um, minus 1, the derivative of y, times dy dx, because I just took the derivative of something that has a y in it, right? And then that's the derivative of the top times the bottom, which is x plus 2y. And then minus the top, which is 2x minus y, times the derivative of the bottom, which is going to be 1 plus 2 dy dx. You should know why just wrote dy dx. And all of this, of course, is divided by the bottom squared. So um, all of this is divided by the bottom, which is x plus 2y squared. I could attempt to simplify the numerator, or it might just make sense to evaluate here, which is to just plug in our numbers here. I'm just going to evaluate. I'm going to be lazy and evaluate here. It shouldn't be too hard. I'll help you figure out a simplifying step. And when we are ready to evaluate, we normally write a vertical bar. So, you know, dy, d squared y dx squared, which is a second derivative, which is all of this junk vertical bar, which means I'm evaluating at 3, 0, right? Okay. So the simplifying step is this. Well, since you'll have to figure out what dy dx is at 3, 0 here and here, uh, you might as well find um, where dy dx, which is that, um, uh, happens to equal at 3. 3 comma 0. So dy dx evaluated at 3 comma 0 is going to be equal to, using this expression, 2 times 3 minus 0 over um, 3 plus 2 times 0, and that's 2. So we know we're going to replace this fella and this fella with 2. Okay, otherwise we just plug in the corresponding x and y values, because that's all there is to do here. So doing that, we get that the second derivative, d squared y, dx squared, evaluated at 3 comma 0, is going to equal, remember I'm going to make use of the fact that dy dx evaluated at 3 comma 0 is 2. Okay, so it's going to be 2 minus 1 times 2, so 2 minus 2. And so then I, I shouldn't even care about what that is. I'm just going to write it as x plus 2y, because I know that that's going to go to 0, the whole thing. And then minus, um, and then it's 2 times x is 3, y is 0, and then times 1 plus 2 times dy dx is 2. So 2, all of this divided by, and uh, I'm going to insist I use the ruler for the divided by so that my work remains neat. Okay, so divided by, if it was neat in the first place, right? I'm assuming that. Um, I hope it was. I hope you agree. 3 plus 2 times 0. 
squared. Got it. So this, if I simplify it again, this whole thing is going to go to 0, 2 minus 2 is 0, 0 times anything is 0. And so then we have that, and then minus, this is 6, and then this is 1 plus 4, so that, that's 5. So we have negative 30 in the numerator, and then the denominator we should have 3 times 2 plus 0 is just 3, 3 squared is 9. And we know that both of these guys take 3, so we can simplify dividing by 3 numerator and denominator, and that will turn into 10, negative 10 thirds, which is answer choice A. All right, cool. Take care.